large area of Vauxhall has been cornered off. I'd say there's six or seven appliances from the fire engine here. And what's clear is that the helicopter has hit a crane on the third tower, which is a new building at Vauxhall. You can actually see the damage to the crane. Uh, there, there's still smoke billowing out. Um, as the police are saying, it's very confusing at the moment. Uh, there's lots of people in the rush hour getting caught out. So as you can hear, I'm being asked to move away now. Um, but there's obviously a lot of uh, attention here. A lot of the clients have done a lot of police. We saw them all pass the commuters as they were going. Uh, and I think at the moment, it's, it's not quite clear what is happening. And are we actually talking about it being downed on a road or off a road? It looks like it could be just off the side of the road. You can see that you can actually see some of the wreckage um, just uh, from the roadside, and you can see smoke billowing out. It's just past the bridge, so I would suspect that this uh, road is going to be blocked off for quite a while. Weather conditions for you there, Robert? I presume grey, cloudy, overcast. Any sense of wind or any any other bad weather? It's very clear, but there is a very low hanging uh, cloud which actually means that you can barely see the top of the building, uh, which might s s explain why the helicopter hit here. But as you say, you can actually see parts of the crane hanging down from the building, so that will also provide an issue because I'm sure that they'll have to evacuate that area should the uh, crane actually, parts of the crane fall down.